Hey everyone, welcome back to JLeg 3D. So it's been a hot minute, but here we are. Uh, as you guys have, uh, most of you probably have seen my split body tutorial, and you know that you can use a body to split another body. So what we can do is tools, split body. We want this body split, and we can use this body to split it, right? But the problem is, what if I want to split more than just once? Can I select another face? No, you can't. Very unfortunate. You can't select multiple faces to split at the same time. So uh, the user on Facebook actually asked this question and I came up with a pretty interesting solution. It's not perfect, consider it like an experimental option, but I think it's pretty nifty. So let's hide that body and let's create a new sketch. And what we're gonna do is use a spline. So what I wanna do is obviously as, as straight as possible on this line. So I'm gonna make really long splines here. And I'm kind of just going to go back and forth just a bit to make them as straight as possible. And let's actually stop with that one, move this over there. And then what I want to do is offset this one. Doesn't really matter how much as much, but we do need to close the sketch there. And then we can go and extrude that one then as you can see, it's still all one face. It's, it's a spline, so it's still connected. So the cool thing is here, if everything works properly, we can technically use this split body on here with this face. And as you can see, we now have a little trick to cutting up multiple faces, which is obviously really hard to do uh, with exactly straight lines at this point. But if you guys have a better idea of how to do it, help me out community. Um, I'm not the only one who should be teaching others. You guys are here as well. So how cool is this though? That's another way to use Shaper better. Hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And tell me what kind of problems are you guys having in Shaper? I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.